Hey fellow enthusiasts, if you want to know what our family tradition is in the month of March, then this video is for you. Here we go. Hey fellow enthusiasts, this is Tommy Lanham. And I'm Tammy. And I'm Apollonia. And I'm Dylan. <laughs> and we are on a mission to break the monotony of the mundane and the mediocre by bringing as much enthusiasm to as many marriages and families as we possibly can. Hey guys, for several years, ever since our kids were really little, we have had a family tradition in the month of March. We fill out our basketball brackets. Now even before they could write, I would sit down and I would say, okay, between this team and this team, who do you want? And I would write it in. And my son, who I introduced to the Dukes of Hazard at a very young age, Whenever I would go through the brackets, whenever I would say the, the team Duke, he would automatically pick them because he connected it with the Dukes of Hazard. <coughs> He's grown out of that, so we're proud of that because we are not Duke fans. We are Kentucky Wildcat fans, as you can tell by the shirts. <laughs> we have filled out our brackets. We will start on the left with Apollonia. My final four are Kentucky, Texas Tech, Michigan, and Kansas. And who wins? Kentucky. All right. My final four is Kentucky, North Carolina, Villanova, and Auburn with Kentucky winning it all. Two SEC teams. That's awesome. <laughs> She's even braver than I am. My final four is Gonzaga, Michigan State, Villanova, and the Kentucky Wildcats. And I've got the Wildcats beating Villanova in the final game. Now here's our Oddball the family for this year. I have Xavier, Virginia, Villanova, and Kansas in the final four. And I have Virginia winning it all. So he is the only one in the family who does not have the UK Wildcats <coughs> winning the tournament. Now, we do this every year in March. We get together, we fill out these brackets, and then starting last year, we had a little competition <coughs> where we would keep score throughout the whole tournament. And the winner last year got to have a second birthday. And the winner last year was... Me! Apollonia. So later in the year, she planned a, a another birthday party. Last year, she got to have a second birthday. This year, we haven't completely agreed yet on what the prize is. So we're going to have to do that soon. But we keep score, and we all like competition, so we keep track of the scores we go through just to find out who is leading and who's going to win. Now, what is the purpose of shooting a video like this for you guys? Why do you care <laughs> what, we, what we do in March? Here's the thing. It builds tradition into our family. We look forward to this all year long, probably more me than the others, but all of us to some extent, and especially as March gets close, we start anticipating that. We love sitting down and, and writing out our brackets, and we just have fun with it. We're not saying, hey, go do brackets like we do, but what we are saying is, find something in your family that you do together, something that you do every year or ever so often that you get together and you do something and it builds memories and 20, 30 years down the road you're going to look back and go, oh, remember when we had a prize as a second birthday and, and Apollonia had her second birthday or, or whatever your tradition may be. If you've already got one, great, continue to do that. If you don't have one, begin now. Begin some kind of tradition in addition to your typical traditions with the holidays and the birthdays and stuff like that. But what are those additional traditions that's unique to your family that you can do together? We do it as a family. We even go to my mom's house. She doesn't fill out brackets, but she does watch most of the games with us. So we go to her house and we watch the games. It's just a great family tradition. Last year was awesome because I was born in the winter and I've always wanted a summer birthday. So I got a late summer birthday and it was awesome and I got to have a pool party for the first time in my life. But one of our big traditions is March Madness. What you got to do is find your madness in your family and celebrate that because it will feed your enthusiasm. Hey guys, if you want to be 
become a part of the fellow enthusiast community, one of the best ways to do that is to subscribe to my YouTube channel by clicking the button below. Go ahead, do it. I know you want to do it. Do it now. Come on. You think of it like Christmas. <laughs>